Hey guys, this is Eric from Pin Pioneer, and I'm here with another really cool video demo. Today we're going to talk about scheduling, and scheduling is quite commonly overlooked, uh, which is a shame because it's very, very powerful if used correctly and if used um, supplementary to the time delays. Maximize your returns, minimize your time taken, set and forget, leave your app running overnight when you're out of town, when you're grabbing a beer, where whatever it might be. It's very quick and very easy to do. So to get started, just go ahead and type in a keyword to search, hit scrape, and choose your search function. I use all for Flickr. So I'm using skateboarding, pick any picture, select it, right click, and then hit add to scheduler. This will bring up a nice scheduling window like so. And as a result, this will then let you do everything you usually do in the main window, whether it's add a board name, add a source URL, add a picture description, etc. Uh, in this case, picture descriptions are necessary. Pinterest won't accept any pins without descriptions. So if you don't have a description, it just won't work. So make sure whether you're using the main window or using the scheduling window, have a picture description. Anyway, so let's go ahead and set a time. It's currently 3.18 here. So let's say for 3.19, let's set a time. Okay. Like so, hit add schedule. Now see how it went blue at first? That means it's pending scheduling. Once the time arrives, 3.19 p.m., it will go ahead and turn to this color above. So in about 10 seconds, you'll see what I mean. This is very handy. Um, you can schedule mass pins, run multiple instances of the program, schedule mass pins for YouTube, and then do the same for um, repins and Flickr. So as you can see here, it's changed color. Very cool. If we go back to our Pinterest page, um, you can see it says 25 pins. If we refresh, it should say 26 or 27, 26, uh, by the nature of things. Really cool. Done. Completely automatic, completely autonomous. Leave it, set and forget, and go ahead and enjoy a nice cold brewski, as they say. Anyway, so that's that. Um, very easy to do. Stay tuned for our next video. Thanks.